All right, everybody. Welcome. I'm going to do today, since we've been missing out, take the request that people have given me, and that is Gollum. And I probably just said his name wrong. But, in any case, we're going to start with a big old circle. And welcome back from my leave. I know I haven't been doing it for the past week or so. Go ahead and we'll kind of, kind of, let's see, we can go ahead and do lines. This is where the eye is going to be. Go straight down. Get his little chin. Head coming up. He's got a huge head. Because he doesn't have much else going on. He's really just giant baldness. Which nobody likes. That's probably why he's halfway he's mad all the time. It's not about the rings, because I'm bald. Uh, sympathy. I give you sympathy, my man. Alright. Got some ears. Got our lines. There you got his chin. It really kind of shortens up. Um, and we'll do a little neck. Kind of bend out. Ooh, it's kind of like a giraffe. Do a little giraffe neck. <laughs> and we'll do kind of a hunch over back. Uh, he was always known for that. Kind of come down his arms. And we'll put some humps for his spinal cord. Because it was weak and horrible. Because he did nothing but live in a cave. When, that would make you feel just as bad, wouldn't it? I know I would. Alright, so. Got kind of a little body there. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just throw some lines over here in his ears. Just because it uh, gives something a little bit different there. Um, oh, let's go ahead, just for the hell of it, put some hair. Wiggle it down. Right. So he does have some hair. It's just like straggling. It's probably for the last ones he pulled off. and Who knows what. Some behind the ear. And we're going to come down. Make your little marks. Your eyes, nose, mouth. His mouth is going to be open, so we really don't need to worry about that. It was like an ah box. Ah, I'm mad. And we're going to do some eyes. And just do large circles. I mean, look, he looks like a possessed monster. Ugh. A zombie. That's more interesting. Okay. So, we have our eyes. Let's go down here to the nose. We'll kind of just... Uh, do kind of like it's a, uh, a big uh, mushroom. It's like a mushroom. That's a good way of saying it. It's a mushroom. See, we'll put a little tail. There's a mushroom. Put a little crevice on both sides. Actually, you can probably put a little smarter there. Come around. Give some crevices to his, his mouth, his cheeks. Uh, uh, his lips. Here we go. We're going to do... I like it's concaving in a little bit. Uh, you know, like, oh, I can't believe I just put that in my mouth. That was rotten. Just, just like yesterday when I was rotten. And we've got some lips, we've got some small right here. We'll do a little small and then make this really large. Just for impact. Not because he actually has large lips. <laughs> and you want to make his teeth kind of jagged. Because, you know, he's probably been eating a rock for some reason. I'm not explaining why. It just makes me think. You want, he, since he's he down there in that little spot, he's probably eating rocks. There's a little tongue. Well, hey, we'll put a little dimple chin in there. Yeah, a little dimple chin. Alright, All right, so we got, we'll pull some lines up here. Because he's got those wrinkles coming in. Stress. So much stress. All that stress from that ring. He can't stand it. Bring that come around. Alright, now we got to actually get into a little bit more detail so you can pin out who he is. Here we go, put the little marks right there, just right around the circles. And we're going to kind of stop it and make uh, this little hunch pieces right there. That's going to be his eyebrows. Kind of hunch down like, I can't believe I'm mad. And let's see, we're going to follow it around from that circle, do kind of upside down half moons. Alright, and then right here, we're going to almost make it completely straight. Um, kind of come up around. See? Hopefully it's working out for you, like, uh, for me. It's okay if it's different. I don't expect it to be the same. There we go. And then put some circles for the actual eye part. And then we're going to put little black dots. Like he's freaking out. I oh, like he can't take this anymore. I'm going to put a little white. Wait, here he is right there. 
I go ahead and darken this in a little bit so you can see his teeth coming up. Uh, there we go. Ah, that looks a little bit better. All right. All right. So we got kind of our golem happening here. Maybe I should throw. Why not? We're going to do something out of the blue. This is made up. We're going to throw the ring in there. Ooh, the ring. And I'm just kind of playing around with this. Doesn't have to be like me. Oh, you don't even have to add that in there. I just thought it'd be kind of interesting. It's kind of like, ooh, shiny. All right, and I'll darken that in. Whoop. Got his fingers looking at it. Ah, oh, mm, I want that. Hmm. We're we'll darkening the uh, arms right there. Bring it around the neck. There we go. Bring up the back. All right. There we go. We're gonna do the ears next. Down around, bring around the chin. Whoop. Cover the head up. See? Well, not really cover the head up, but just make a nice line. Bring out some crazy hair. Doot, doot, doot. Crazy hair. Mouth. Arr. Right? Look at that. Mmm. He's growling. He's mad. He's mad because he has no eyebrows. Like, how dare you? Right? Put that in there for the cheekbone. Go back up here to the eyes. Bring lines around. Alright. Put these little hunches in there. Ah, nice little lines. Go around, put a little black dot. Darken that up if we can. All right. Got those lines in there. I'll bring back this so we don't have to get too dark for the rest. I could probably erase some. Or, I mean, I don't know. That's kind of cool like that. It kind of gives you some, some actual wrinkles as well. Um, I'll try to do it so you can see it a little bit better. Uh, maybe we can see uh, if I'm missing something. Because it looks like, well, I should probably show some eyebrow in there. What do you think? I think I should show some eyebrow. I'm thinking so. Looking at it. Looks like it needs some eyebrow. So, how about we shade? Let's see, I'll shade right in here to make those eyes menacing. Uh, ooh. If you always want to make something really horrible looking as far as like you haven't had sleep all day or you're mad with the world or if you feel like you're possessed, darken around the eyes. That always works good. Um, a little lot. Um, yeah, let's darken this up around here. We need, a, we need some angry. We need to be angry. All right, Gollum? So, do do. You know, I'll just turn this in. That looks kind of neat. Let's do this real quick. The shadow. Throw that in there. Nothing special. Just something different. And uh, I'll, I'll fill this in a little bit too. So I hope this came out like you might like. It's Gollum. It's different. It's, um, I like doing some of these more realistic ones compared to your regular cartoons at times but uh, yeah um, let me know below if you have any comments if you like it you don't like it or um, if uh, I mean by looking at it right now it looks like it's slide halfway um, I didn't realize I'm going to slide but 
any case, I hope you like, and I will continue with another drawing next.